Becca is trying to find her place at an internship um, with the hilarious and intimidating uh, Keegan Michael Key, um, who was uh, a joy to work with. And he came in on the very last two days of filming after everybody else had left, all the girls had left, and like done their like tearful goodbyes about like we wrapped and we're sisters. And I was like, I still have to keep making this movie. Um, and uh, you know that was with Keegan, and that was so much fun to. Um, uh, to have as like the coda to my to my experience on this film and um, and uh, uh, right what's the plot of the movie um, the uh, the Bellas um, you know the stakes are higher because of that stuff that happens in the movie um, <laughs> you know because they get kicked out and they're trying to um, you know get reinstated through a very very weird. Um, uh, sort of set of bylaws, I guess. I saw the movie last night, and I brought a friend, and he was like, why didn't they initiate Emily into the Bellas until the end of the movie? And I was like, you know, because they had to get reinstated, but so they had to win the world. And he was like, oh, I didn't get that. It's definitely less intimate than the first one. The first one was much more, you know, it's like felt in intimate. It was shot in a much more intimate way, and you know, the um, the girls sort of felt like this, like, sort of ragtag team, and this one is, like, sort of pulled back and, and much glossier and, you know, um, much more polished. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, it yeah, I think there, there are definitely times where it doesn't feel like the same group of girls, but hopefully, like, there are scenes where it feels like we're yeah. still, you know, uh, losers. That's the goal. That's my goal. You know, it was about... Um, you know, watching a group of women interact with each other um, and discover that they could be a support system for each other. And um, I think that that's, you know, just a world that you want to live in. You know, my f favorite movies when I was um, younger were definitely um, all sort of female-centric uh, movies. And so I can see why that would resonate. You know, um, uh, Haley hadn't seen Sister Act 2, and we showed her Sister Act 2, and I was like, oh, right. Like, I just assumed that everybody's seen that movie, and, um, you know, because there's so much um, in in Pitch Perfect and in Pitch Perfect 2 that's, like, really, you know, sort of eerily similar to, to movies like that. And it's like, right, but this generation needs that movie, I guess.